Hey y'all and welcome back to the Sprinkle Factory YouTube channel where we cover everything culinary. This is Chef Sprinkle and I'm back with another delicious recipe. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and of course join our Sprinkle Squad. Of course, as always, you can find my seasonings and my honey garlic lemon pepper sauce on my website. And as always, the website link will be in the description below. Now today, let's get right into it. We are making sugar cookie peach cobbler y'all yes you heard me right super easy and i promise you everybody is going to beg you to make this over and over again super easy let's start off with some frozen peaches you guys and as always the ingredients will be at the end of the video along with the cooking times and temps and all that good stuff so we're going to start with the frozen peaches in a pan and we're going to hit it with some of the honey butter cinnamon roll sweet seasoning again you can find that on the website season that up we're going to add in some brown sugar some butter some vanilla some cornstarch all of the good stuff to make it really sweet, tasty, and thick. And then we are going to top it with the sugar cookies. Now, as you guys see, we are going to heat this pan on about a medium heat, medium low, just until the butter melts fully and the peaches are slightly thawed and creates this beautiful, delicious syrup. The next thing that we're going to do is grab our cookie dough, you guys. I've used Pillsbury. I've also used Toll House, and they both work just fine, just the same. And we are going to top the cobbler with the cookies. Simple, easy as that. And, of course, it's your discretion. Put as many or as least cookies as you guys want again that is totally up to you it's all going to bake the same it's all going to come together super super delicious we're going to layer that on there and then believe it or not we are done Super easy, y'all. May just take a little bit of patience to get everything situated and arranged however you want them. Um, but once that's done, we are going to pop this in the oven 30, 35 minutes at 350. Again, that temp and everything, the ingredients will be at the end of the video. As you guys can see here, I just sprinkle a little bit more honey butter, cinnamon roll seasoning on top. Cannot go wrong with it. It actually makes the cookies taste slightly snickerdoodle, if you ask me. Um, but go ahead and throw it in the oven, you guys. Once it comes out, you literally just scoop it out, serve it hot with some ice cream. And I literally promise your loved ones, your family, your friends, the bae, they're going to continue to ask you, when are you making the sugar cookie peach cobbler again? Yes, you can definitely substitute apples. That is delicious as well. And if you follow me on TikTok or any other social medias, y'all, on the apple one, I actually added a little bit of Hennessy too. That's for the grown and sexy, yes. Um, but it did come out super, super delicious, you guys. This is a no-fail recipe. All you have to do is thaw the peaches, season them, and bake the entire thing. Um, but of course, if you are new here, one thing that we do do is slow it down with a slow mode. And just like that, we have made sugar cookie peach cobbler, y'all. Thank y'all so, so, so much. I love y'all. Thank you always for watching and supporting me and my passion. I love y'all forever. As my grandma would say, this is finger licking time. You guys, make sure you write down the ingredients. Catch the temperature and the bake time at the bottom. Um, make sure you comment, share, leave a like, share with all your family and friends. And as always, I'll see y'all next time.